Hey, this is Quinlan. Uh, I just wanted to make this video to put sort of pen to paper on an idea I've had for a little while. Um, just an easier way to share addresses is the primary use. So very simply, if I just had a friend coming over to my house for the first time, instead of typing out the full address, I could just send him a sticker that has my house's name and that's fully customizable. I can put any sort of custom instructions I want in there and then I'm also certain he's going to be going to the right place. He can just quickly click a Google Ways, Google Maps or Ways or whatever link to my house and know it's verified. I think this could stretch beyond addresses from what little I know about blockchain. If you were to build this on say Ethereum's platform maybe you could send a bank account number or a Bitcoin wallet address and it would be encrypted using blockchain and, and verify you could verify the sender and recipient but um, that's further down the road right now I'm just sick of typing my address out to uh, people um, let's get started alright so this is what like the main screen would look like to uh, say set your primary address I'm gonna call my house Burlap's Abode. And this is the sticker I'm gonna to use to send to friends and family, uh, businesses that are sending, say they're sending me a package. Um, so yeah, this is obvious. Make sure everything's correct once and then you can forget about it. Uh, my special instructions are I just have a garage code. Um, I really like the special instructions idea because you could have, you know, a whole page. Say it's an Airbnb. The, the special instructions could be its own tab that opens up and just have the Wi-Fi, uh, lockbox number, whatever. And then there, that's how it's saved. So I'm going to save this in my keyboard at, as something I can type just like that. Or, of course, I can just copy and paste it, but if it's your own address, you want it in your keyboard. If other people are using it, and maybe they don't save it in their keyboard, maybe they just use it as a copy and paste function, both ways will work the same. When you click it, it exposes what, you know, the, the intel is, the info regarding the sticker. And in this case, it's an address. Um, you can save it into your contacts. You can enter ways. This would be... If I were to paste it, I would just ways. We would have to integrate it in a way that Ways and Google Maps just recognizes the sticker as an address, so that you can either paste it or type it directly in. But um, once you get your addresses set up, it's just it would be so streamlined, and you never worry about messing up a digit or typing it out. It's so annoying. Same thing. Uh, online shops could have an address field for just stickers. So. Say your friend's like, hey, I want to send you this new uh, candle from ha Haven's a cool local store, actually. That's why I picked it. You don't have to uh, write your address out to them. You just send them the sticker. Now I'm showing how you would save someone's address um, using the sticker. Again, this field would just recognize the sticker as a universal language. Um, there you have it. So yeah, it's just like super advanced copy and paste. This is a fun idea I had. Instead of printing out shipping labels, instead of printing out shipping labels, we could, the mailers or box of a package could just have a, um, sorry, like a company logo or a business logo with either its own barcode or sort of where another idea I want to spawn this off into is instead of having like a really ugly barcode or a QR code, let's find a way to take logos and digitize them so that it's a it's a beautiful picture of a logo that is what scans and takes you to a web page or in the shipping example a USPS driver could just pick up that package and when he scans it he gets the address um, obviously there are, I'm sure there's um, examples where you still need to have that written address but it seems like for most orders um, no one is actually reading the uh, the label. They're using digital scanners. I mean, at least I know Amazon. I don't know. I'm 
I'm obviously over my head a little bit, but I'd rather take action and get your guys' feedback on what seems plausible than just have the idea in my head and wait too long. Um, so yeah, let me know what you think. There's, uh, I just love this idea because it keeps spawning off into new ways that could be helpful, but as far as step one, let's just find a way to stop having to write our address out in full. It's so annoying. I know